Do you have a car? If yes, click the subscribe button now. Believe us, sooner or later you will need our help. We bet that you had to replace a burnt out headlight bulb at least one time in the past. Don't go to an expensive dealer for a simple bulb replacement. Subscribe to this channel and save time and money. Here you will find the best in the world information about halogen, xenon, and LED headlights. Based on more than 20 years experience, we will also show you how to troubleshoot and repair your headlights. Subscribe, camera, action, lights. Hi guys, in this video, I will show you in case of uh, full beam failure what you should do in order to repair your headlight actually if you have a low beam and if you don't have a full beam at your opal insignia by xenon headlight basically it's a uh, beyond repair i mean it you can repair it but uh, it will be uh, very time consuming labor consuming and still you will have a repaired headlight which which is not recommended for this model. It's always better to, uh, to buy a replacement unit, intact replacement unit, by the way. So let me continue. If you have a low beam at your insignia by Xenon headlight, but if you don't have a high beam, full beam, it means that uh, your by Xenon shutter inside the headlight is faulty. Let me show you. Basically, this is a, uh, as you know, this is a bi-xenon headlight, which means that your low beam and the high beam are at one uh, bulb, D1S type bulb. And there is a shutter inside this headlight, which uh, depending on your commands, on your switch, basically uh, makes a low beam or a high beam. So. If you have a low beam, it means that your ballast unit underneath the headlight is working. It generates power. But if you don't have a full beam, it means that uh, your bi-xenon shutter inside the, uh, inside the headlight is faulty. Basically, if you diagnose your headlight, you will have a error code B0984004, the left headlight. And for the right head, headlamp, you will have B098500 error code. If you have a, such an error code, it means that, I don't know whether you can see or not, but under the, under the projector, there is a black plate. There is an electronic circuit inside this black plate and underneath the projector. As you can see, the, there is one blue plug there. Basically, this electronic circuit commands your full beam actuator and all of your IFS function of your headlight. So if you don't have a full beam, it means that either your electronic circuit, which is located under inside this black plate is faulty or the, let me show you, or the full beam actuator, which is this one, black box, is faulty. So either this black box actuator is faulty or your electronic plate inside your headlight is faulty. Actually, in, uh, this electronic plate is hanged in the air. I mean, it's not at the bottom of the headlight. If this part gets faulty, it means that you have a severe moisture water ingress issue in your headlight. So in any case, uh, you have to repair your headlight if you have a, such a severe moisture. Uh, in order to repair e either the electronic plate or the actuator, basically you, you have to find another headlight and replace these parts from, from the spare headlight but it's very time consuming uh, operation. And believe me, it's not working. In such a, in such a uh, situation, it's better for you to buy a cool intact replacement unit, headlight unit. I know that these headlights are stupidly expensive headlights. Uh, sometimes uh, 
it's uh, you can think that it, it can you can save some uh, money and time by repairing it but believe me at the end if once you open this headlight you it means that you will have a lot of trouble in the future you will have probably condensation which means that your ballast unit will fail which means that your uh, LED driver inside will fail shortly again it, it means that your shutter can fail which which all these parts are very expensive at this headlight it's it's the simple solution is i know that it's over 500 600 euro the new one but believe me the cheapest solution for this problem just buy a new headlight or you have to buy a used one but intact i hope this helps thanks for watching guys don't forget to subscribe to my channel all the best bye for now